Hello everyone. I hope everyone is doing good and all is well. Today's chat is going to be a very controversial one, but I'm not a biased person, so we're still going to discuss it. You know, I've got to drop my disclaimer before we begin. My Haitian brothers and sisters, I'm only reporting the written history. No disrespect or nothing like that, and I don't want no smoke, so please don't come for me. But anyway, today's chat is going to be about the Haitian massacre that occurred in 1804. Now, the massacre was said to have been carried out against the native French people and French Creoles in Haiti. And the massacre took place from January of 1804 until April 22nd of 1804. Now, according to the reports, the massacre, it, record, it resulted in the death of three to five thousand white men, women and children. Or did it? Now, I say that to say this. Several other sources say that the tale of the massacre is exactly that. Just a mere exaggerated tale. And after today's chat, I want you all to tell me what you all believe. And with that being said, let's chat. Before we talk about the Haitian massacre, we must talk about the Haitian Revolution. Now, the Haitian Revolution is known as the largest and most successful slave rebellion in the Western Hemisphere. And it's also known as a very complex revolution because it consisted of several revolutions taking place simultaneously. Now, it is said that the revolutions were influenced by the French um, Revolution of, eight, of 1789, and they represented the universal citizenship, a new concept of human rights, and participation in government. Now, the slaves were said to have initiated the rebellion in 1791, and they successfully succeeded in 1803. Now, they succeeded at not only ending slavery, they also ended the French control over the colony, and Haiti became the first country to be founded by former slaves. Now, let's get on to the massacre. Now, according to the reports, General Jean, General Jean Jacques de Salines, he led the rebels in declaring Haitian independence on January the 1st, 1804. Now, he was second in command under Toussaint Louverture. I'm sorry if I butchered that name, um, but he was under him during the Haitian Revolution. Now, please forgive me um, if I'm mispronouncing any names. Y'all know I got the accent, too. But y'all help me out in the comments below. You, I know y'all will. But Desalines, he said to have ordered an organized cleansing to rid Haiti of the remaining white population of French natives and French Creoles who remained after the Haitians declared their independence. Now, in January of 1804, it is said that Haitian soldiers went from door to door, torturing and taking the lives of entire families, women and children included. Now, the white people who were said to have been cordial and helpful to the slaves, they were also killed, according to the reports. Now, when it was all said and done and estimated Three to five thousand lives were taken when the massacre was over. And according to one of the former slaves, the Haitians, they committed the acts against the remaining white people because of how they had previously treated the form well, the slaves or former slaves now because they had their independence. And according to the former slave, the Haitians had been treated like wild dogs. Their decapitated bodies were hung upside down. They were drowned in sacks. They were crucified on planks. They were buried alive. They were crushed in mortars. They were forced to consume feces. They were cast alive to be devoured by worms or placed in ant hills. They were impaled by stakes in the swamps and devoured by mosquitoes. They had boiling hot cauldrons of cane syrup thrown on them. The men and women were put in barrels of spikes and rolled down mountain sides into the abyss. And if all of that wasn't already horrible enough, 
the ones who actually did survive the torture, they were finished off with bayonets. Now, it's very sad and heartbreaking what happened. I mean, the massacre included, well, that's if a massacre took place. Now, according to some reports, there was no such thing as a Haitian massacre. And the tale of the Haitian massacre is just that, a mere exaggerated tale. Now, according to those reports, when the French evacuated Haiti in late 1803, some of the French soldiers refused to accept defeat. And a small group of the troops, they began threatening an invasion to annihilate the black population. Now, Dessalines, he was said to have gotten wind of their plans. And now remember, he's the one who led the rebels and was said to have ordered the cleansing or the massacre. But it is said that when he got wind of the troops plans, he also discovered that the remaining white colonists had planned to support the troops with their attack. So he then ordered the execution of the people who played an active role in the different massacres and assassinations that the French had committed against the black people, not a cleansing of all of the white people, as some of the reports claim. Now, also, historical documents have revealed that a partial census from October of 1804 It lists more than 600 white people in the district of Gross Morn alone shortly after all of the white people were alleged to have been deceased. So I really don't know, but I'm going to let you all tell me what you think. And well, you know, that brings us to the end of today's chat. So I would definitely love to know what you all think. I know it's a very controversial story and we probably would never know the full truth. But do you all believe that there was really a massacre or cleansing of the white people in Haiti? Or do you believe only the white people who committed the terrible acts against the slaves were cleansed? Go ahead and drop your comments below. And remember, you know, over here, we can agree to disagree respectfully of course you know we don't want nobody disrespecting anybody in the comments and you all please like the video please subscribe if you haven't already if you would like to support the channel the information to support will be in the description of this video below and until next time peace love and blessings